My name is Lisette Van Vliet. I work for the Health and Environment Alliance. We're trying to make sure that the EU protects your health. And I'm Hans Meilemann. I'm working for Pesticide Action Network Europe. And we're trying to get harmful pesticide banned. We're working to get endocrine disrupting chemicals out of Europe. Endocrine disrupting chemicals are harmful for your health and the European Union can take action to make sure that these chemicals are eliminated. So we as Pan Europe are concerned about endocrine disrupting pesticides, pesticides which are capable of changing the hormonal system. And consumers will eat dozens of these pesticides every day. They are in strawberries, they are in apples, they are in lettuce, in cucumbers. So they are exposed to it and they shouldn't be exposed to it at all. So the EU immediately should take action to adopt a strict policy to ban these dangerous pesticides. And food is not the only way you're getting exposed to endocrine disrupting chemicals. There's these kinds of chemicals in all sorts of things that we use in our daily lives, from toys to cash receipts, medical equipment, carpets, flooring, wallpaper, furniture, cables, personal care products, food contact materials, and cosmetics. And what we know about endocrine disrupting chemicals is that the changes they make to our hormone system can result in permanent changes in our body. And there are a lot of chronic diseases which are increasing in incredible speed, and especially the hormone-related diseases such as breast cancer and prostate cancer. Other diseases that are related to endocrine disruption include reproductive health problems in men, problems with the brain development, such as learning disabilities, and metabolic problems such as diabetes and obesity. There are really serious health implications of these endocrine disrupting chemicals. That's why we want the EU to take action. It's really urgent, and the NGO started the EDC Free Campaign. As part of our EDC free campaign, we're calling on the EU to change all the laws to minimize our exposure to EDCs. Secondly, we need a timetable to change all the laws. Thirdly, we want the EU to act much more swiftly on early warning signals that there are problems with certain EDCs and health implications. So fourth, uh, EU should enhance public awareness about the endocrine disrupting chemicals for instance, pregnant women should know about it and should be able to choose alternatives. We'd like you to support our EDC's free campaign to protect your health. You can find more information on the website.